Learning asthma first aid is vital as anyone with asthma can have a life-threatening asthma attack at any stage. Sports staff should know which people have asthma and ensure they have the asthma first aid equipment on standby. Hey Nakia, are you okay? No, it's my asthma. Oh, I'll go get the coach then. She's having an asthma attack. Nakia, are you okay? It sounds like her asthma. I'm gonna get the asthma emergency kit. The first step for asthma first aid is to sit the person down and calmly reassure them. It's okay, I'm here to help. I'm going to give you an asthma reliever medication. The second step is to give four puffs of reliever medication ensuring they shake the puffer well and the mouthpiece of the spacer is forming a good seal on the lips. You need to take one puff, four breaths, and repeat that four times. Press down on the puffer once to fire the medication into the spacer. The person should now breathe in and out normally for four breaths. Repeat this until four puffs have been provided, shaking the puffer between each dose. You're doing a great job in here. Just keep breathing in and out, calm. Now that four separate puffs have been provided, the third step is to wait four minutes. Okay, we're just gonna wait four minutes and see how you feel after that. If there is no improvement after four minutes, give another four separate puffs of relieving medication as in step two. How are you feeling now? I'm feeling much better. Okay, you can go back and join the game now. If the person's symptoms have improved after four minutes, then they can return to playing sport. The fourth step of asthma first aid, if symptoms don't improve, is to call an ambulance on triple zero. Keep giving four separate puffs every four minutes until the ambulance arrives. It doesn't look like we're getting any better after the four puffs, so I'm going to call the ambulance and you'll keep taking that medication every four minutes. 